tonight, word of a crazy crime involving gasoline. Thanks for joining us. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Sasha Loftus. And for Brian tonight, we're told people are using stolen credit cards to buy that gasoline, then selling it in Valley neighborhoods. 8 News Now reporter Kristen Drummond joins us now live in studio to tell us how widespread that problem was. Denise and Sasha Metro Police calling this the most organized crime detectives have investigated involving fuel. The scheme spans multiple jurisdictions and required the assistance of other law enforcement agencies in Clark County, along with the Secret Service. Police say people are using stolen credit cards to make purchases of 100, 200, or even 300 gallons of gas at a time. Metro releasing a PSA today that shows modified cars and vans with hidden containers to hold the fuel for transport. The criminals then sell the gas in neighborhoods or stored in large tanks at homes. Now, there's no law against the amount of fuel you can have on your property, but firefighters' concerns include the unsafe transfer of gas to other cars and improper storage, which may cause an explosion. Last year, Las Vegas Fire and Rescue responded to a truck with a large amount of gas igniting in a garage, and that's not the only case in the valley, so first responders worry Similar situations may happen with hotter days ahead of us. This is something that could level a neighborhood and cost people their lives. Vapors are what burn and not the fuel. So that you can find, you know, with, a, with vapor as the, as the temperature heats up here in southern Nevada uh, and there's an increase of, of this vapor that moves out, it could find an ignition source. Police arrested and charged more than 25 people so far in the last 18 months with this case. Law enforcement add the fuel thieves are also bringing the gas here from bordering states. Now, this PSA will air at terrible gas stations. It will advise drivers on what to look for, including someone using multiple credit cards, taking more than 20 minutes to fill up at the pump, or trucks with external containers and two separate gas tanks. Police also encourage you to call police if you notice a strong smell of gas in your neighborhood. Back to you.